Well, this is uh, a stadium I'm sure you'll recognise, the Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler, and we'll be your commentary team today. And today it's Real Madrid will play Real Betis. Well, confirmation, as if it's needed really. Everyone knows now, don't they, that the league title has been decided. The match will be played, but the big event of the day, Alan's going to be the presentation. Yeah, exactly. I mean, we've seen so many performances that got them to the top of the table. We might not quite see the intensity of those previous displays, but I think you can forgive them for that. This is the Real Madrid lineup. Thibaut Courtois starts in goal. Rafael Varane starts with Sergio Ramos as the centre backs. Tony Kroos starts. He was man of the match in the last game. And the last player on the team sheet is the one main forward. Have a look at how the opposing team will line up today. Aisa Mandi starts alongside Mark Bartra in the heart of defence and a partnership with these two strikers up front. Well, we usually have a little bit of time on our hands when we come to these games, Alan, and another chance to look at that trophy room. It's a wonderful facility for the football and a few other things as well to visit, isn't it? Well, it takes you hours to go around because there's so many trophies in there. It's the third most visited museum in the city. One and a half million punters a year going through there. Modric. Marcelo. Tony Kroos. Aidan Hazard. Bale. Shots on here. Oh, it's awesome. This attacking strength that they've got, they lead again. And they'll be feeling they're going to head for victory again. Such a difficult thing to score on a regular basis at this level of football. But they have found the answer. They've got the formula. A goal from Hazard. And how on earth has he found the right-hand corner from that distance? Not only that, he's done it with a side foot. It's not the easiest to manage to work for, I know that, but these players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Real Madrid in front. Guadado, Sidney, Alonso on the ball. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went to, straight to an opponent. Hazard! Well, it could be a chance! Well, they're waltzing through again. So much attacking confidence, another goal, they're two up now. All the prospects here are of more goals to come. They're the most exciting team that you could ever wish to watch, and they never really disappoint you. They make chances, and most importantly, they take their chances. Their efficiency in front of goal is phenomenal. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. Sydney, Andres Guadado, Inui, Real Madrid able to come forward now, made the challenge well, Cavalio, Guadado, saw the pass coming and got there first. What we've got here is a chance for the home team to do the double over their opponents today, Alan. Yeah, they made a statement, Martin, didn't they, with that earlier win on the way territory, and it was a really good performance. In by Joaquin. 
good defensive clearance there. Uh, cut out by the defender. William Cavallo. Aidan Hazard. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Hazard this time goes for the cross. Here's Casemiro. He's just dropped back in, the striker there, to get the ball in midfield. Casemiro, bail! He's blocked the shot well. well maybe the counter-attack is on here. Well, the opposition are for repositioned now, but they've still got the ball, the attacking team. That's going to be a throw-in after that tackle. The pass not completed, really. Great ball from Bale. Azar. What an opportunity if he picks out the right man. The shot gets blocked. You can see the deflection there. Corner. corner from Tony Kroos Sergio Ramos reaching for it a little bit with the header and that's the expected result back to the training ground I think going into this game for the home side they're in great form aren't they four consecutive wins what uh, a chance to make it five in a row yeah and they must go out on the pitch there full of confidence the way that they've been playing created chances taking them very good Modric can really get at the opposition here he's got his shot off now and he's put it away beautifully excellently placed right into the bottom corner of the net oh it's a great finish to take the keeper at the equation I mean the keeper had no chance there bottom corner two for him on the day and two very well taken goals well I want to see this again this goal And absolutely terrific, this performance so far from Real Madrid. Now Casimiro. Hazard giving the width to this attack. Tony Kroos. Kroos has given it away. Break quickly when they get possession. Strong clearance from the goalkeeper get the ball away from the danger well, that's over the top of the defender and one to chase cleared away by the defender Riyad Budabuz Guadado intercepted well so we've reached the break 3-0 the half-time score well Gareth Bale has gone through the first half here Alan what did you make of his performance he seemed to be all over the pitch in that first half and he was in the box when it mattered to grab himself a couple of goals his team can certainly be thankful for his performance and for their lead Well, we wait to see what the second half brings. The first half was conclusive, but you don't win the game at half-time. Riyad Boudabouz. 
Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Neatly intercepted. Sergio Ramos gives away the free kick. Sergio Ramos is shown the yellow card. Whipped into the box. Well, that's easy for Courtois. An incisive pass. Needs to stay cool now with great vision here. It's unlike him, really, to play the ball straight to the opposition. To throw in for Real Madrid. Danny Ceballos. We've given it straight to the opposition. I see a substitute coming on for the away team here. They've got the ball back by that interception. Just to tell you that the Spanish Cup final is coming up. Next for Real Madrid, they'll be facing Barcelona. Well, I think we're both looking forward to this one. Martin can't wait to get up into the gantry. Riyad Budabuz. Here's Alonso. In by Joaquin. And it's behind for the goal kick. So we're going to see a double switch now. Here's Isco. Bale. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went to straight to an opponent. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. Substitute coming up for the away team. Javi Garcia, looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. Compliment the defender, but not the player trying to cross it. Got a chance to cross. Here is Joaquin. Shots on here. That is one of the great saves. Had no right to stop that. Had no right to get a hand on it. What a stop. It's time for some fresh legs here. Corner's taken. And they get it away. Bale. And 20 minutes to go. This is how they love to play on the break. It must be. Riyad Budabuz. Now Casimiro. Well, here comes the support. Bale's got... And here's the shot. Oh, it's offside. Oh, well, as a striker, you expect to get the benefit there, but he didn't. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. Ceballos. Well, they've got the ball back now in the middle of the field. Some options now for the pass. Put into the middle. Cleared away, well away from goal. Sydney. Cavalier. Doing well to keep the ball. Cross is blocked. He's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy, actually. Rafael Varad. 
Javi Garcia. Asa Mandy. They can spread the play now. Space for the shot. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there and pass goes straight to the opposition. We've got two added minutes. That's been signaled now. Well, in a way, Alan, the game has been irrelevant because already they knew they'd clinch the title. Everyone in the ground, including the players, waiting for the presentation to reward this outstanding season from an outstanding team. Yeah, it's been a party atmosphere, hasn't it, really, from start to finish. I've experienced it myself back in 91 when we played Manchester United. But uh, it doesn't taste any less sweet for those lads down there. And they've enjoyed the game, but really, most of all, they've enjoyed the season. They have been superb, undoubtedly the outstanding team. Well, I think so. Sometimes when their rivals faltered, they kept their eyes fixed firmly on the target and they really did stick together. They had injuries, one or two suspensions, but they kept picking up the results. And now they are about to pick up what it's all about. They are the champions. Oh, wonderful scenes. Scenes and moments they will never forget. You look back in 20 years' time and you'll think about this day. To share it with the supporters. They've had a great bond. Great travelling fans as well as the, uh, the home followers. They certainly haven't been without the backing that every team needs to... No, week in, week out in this most demanding of leagues. Great occasion here. Had time to set it all up, knowing that this presentation day would take place. It didn't depend on the result of the match.